Bucks and Steve, how do you explain the switch of your defense from the first half to the second half? Well, I just sum it up like this, and Cal said this last week, uh, just character, man. Uh, the men in that locker room, uh, I knew for a fact that we were going to win that football game. And it wasn't really a lot, lot of yelling and screaming. We just talked about the things that we had to correct. And everybody just had to do their job. And starting up front, the D-line took control. We started playing a little bit more man-to-man, -man, which has allowed our linebackers to get downhill. And we needed someone to spark us. We talked about trying to, you know, create a takeaway. And 2-6, he carried the ball loose. We mentioned that all week. And when Gip came up with that play, Gibson, man, it was phenomenal. I knew right now that was the one that was going to turn the tide for us. There were a lot of games or a lot of plays that the defense made that one also the fourth down stops did you feel like the door was kind of left open for you guys and the challenge was on your guys to make those fourth down stops well we knew coming in all week that they were going to go for it on fourth down that, i mean that's just who they are and that's why we always talked about really trying to keep them out of third and short because we knew we were going to go for it and then in the second half given the opportunity they did and we rose to the occasion yeah, what, what does it mean just for this unit that, you know, it wasn't a, it wasn't smooth sailing the whole year for this defense, but now there's two teams standing and your unit is one of them. Just to be resilient, you know, it, it's always going to be that somewhat criticism about what we should do. Uh, I know we, we're one or two that's still left, all right, and we're heading to Vegas. And to, to be in this situation, we're going to make the corrections we need to correct. Uh, it's going to be a difficult task ahead. You're talking about two first ballot Hall of Famers and Mahomes and Kelsey. So uh, we got our work cut out for us, but I'm excited about the opportunity that we have and looking forward.